Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week, and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. We'll have every kick of the ball for you live on EA TV. Good evening and welcome to Alcor, welcome to the Al Bayt Stadium, the venue for this one. I'm your match commentator Derek Ray and sitting alongside me, the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player Stuart Robson. And both teams looking to get off to a flying start here on match day one for them at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. How's it going to go Stuart? Well thanks Derek, this is such an important game. Both sides will be desperate to start this group well. Let's hope we see some great football today. Here's how Norway will begin the game. Well, they're playing in a 4-5-1 formation, which is set up to counter-attack at pace. Yes, they'll play with a flat midfield out of possession, but when they win the ball back, they'll break forward really quickly. Let's hope they play it well today. The opposition starting 11. Fernando Muslera is the goalkeeper. Jose Maria Jimenez plays with Diego Godin at the back. Federico Valverde plays with Rodrigo Bentancur in the centre of midfield. And up front, Edinson Cavani plays with Luis Suarez. And the match begins. Pedersen, Frederik Aursnes. Well, the attack looks promising. Being egged on by the crowd. Spot on with that tackle. Well, if you're the opposing defender, you've really got to keep a weather eye on Erling Haaland. What are you expecting to see from him in this game, Stuart? Well, we know he's a good all-round player, but his strength is when balls are rolled into him. He can hold up the play, he can roll defenders, he can get away from them, and that's key to the way his team want to play. When they get the ball into him, that's when they're at their strongest. Ideal for the goalkeeper, for any keeper. Frederik Aursnes. Pedersen. Holland. In with a chance! And it's in! 1-0, they breach the defence. Well, let's see this again. The vision to play this through ball is superb, and the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. Showing good vision. Getting forward. Well read to ease the pressure. That's very effective. Good high pressing. Pedersen. It's with Erdogan. Virgo Solberg-Melling. 
Morton Torsby. Holland. And space to cross it. Could be. And he's outdone himself. Wonderful save there. They've regained possession. Morton Torsby. Pedersen. Well, keeping hold of the ball is what it's all about for them. Torsby. Virgo Solberg Melling. It's with Erdogan. Well, they must exercise caution standing off as they are. Mastery of the passing game. Just wanted to get it out of there. The Arascaeta. The attack continues. They're making considerable progress. Suarez. It has to be. Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. So the whistle then. We're up the halfway stage in this match. Well, we expected he would be a creative figure out there. Simply hasn't worked out that way, Stuart. Well, he's not played at his best today, but let's give some credit to the opposition. They've closed him down quickly, stopped him dictating the play, and controlled that area of the pitch. That's why they're winning at the moment. So, back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect. Wants to attack from the wide areas. No possibilities inside the box. And he's got to clear his lines. Martin Odegaard. And he read it well. Jimenez. Now Godin. Useful looking position, you've got to say. And there didn't seem to be too much in that offside decision. Frederick Aursnes. So a half an hour remaining. Torsby. And a chance, Udegaard. And it's gone in. The team's separated by two goals now. You cannot say they don't deserve it. Well, this is a very tidy finish, as you can see. He's under so much pressure, but his strength just allows him to hit through the ball cleanly. It's an excellent goal. goal. 2-0 here, and the ball is moving again. Naitan Nandes. Well, beating his opponent. Luis Suarez at the ready. And a goal kick given. A lot to like about Martin Odegaard and his performance up to this point. Stuart, I know you've enjoyed it. Well, he has that assist to his name, but it's been his control of that midfield area that's made him the outstanding player today. Every time he gets on the ball, he seems to find the right pass. He's been excellent. Fantastic work here just to keep possession. Well, no stopping him. Oh, what an opportunity! Well, the keeper is happy, the bar was there. 
And a goal! A running riot here, almost out of sight. Well, just look at this. He's so bright in the box. He's first to the ball and then a decent finish. It's a good bit of play. without reply no and successfully cut out Alexander Surlot back to Holland Make some progress with the ball at his feet. Takes the shot. Just made sure nothing came of that. Torsby. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. El Yunusi. It was an excellent example of how to break at pace. Well, that's counter-attacking football at its best. They switch on so quickly when they win the ball back. It deserved a goal. So three minutes of stoppage time coming up. He's got the right idea with that pass. Another goal! The lead grows to four now. A rampant display. Well, we won't get tired of watching this because the interplay around the box is wonderful. And what a finish from Haaland. It gives the keeper absolutely no chance. It's such a powerful strike. A lopsided contest, 4-0. So with that, we can now say it's all over. And the outcome they were hoping for, certainly. A victory, and you can't argue with that, Stuart. Well, Derek, what a good performance that was. They did most things right, and their attacking play was inventive and had a real cutting edge. That was a really dominant display from them today. Well, it truly was a terrific performance by Erling Haaland, really lighting up this game. Well, what more could you ask for? His build-up play was clever, his movement was dynamic, and he scored a couple of goals. What a player he is.